Walter 93 earns Essex draw. Essex started the third day of play at the Cloud County ground in trouble, but Matt Critchley and Paul Walter dug in for an unbeaten stand through to the close of play. The hosts now just 48 behind. Still work to do on the final day, but their position nowhere near as perilous. And with a Critchley single, the fourth wicket partnership was worth a potential match-saving 100 runs. With just three more needed for 50, Critchley was out, frustrated with himself as he picked out Berg off the bowling of Taylor. As he was taking his pads off, long-time partner Walter made his way to 50 with a single off Taylor, the knock one of a determined man. Cushy was now alongside Walter, and once again Essex put together another partnership, one that erased the deficit and took them into a lead. They were worth 50 together shortly after bringing the 200 up. The recovery still on track, but there was some way to go until they were out of the woods. The hosts could have done without the wicket of Cushy, caught behind for Taylor's second of the morning. Some hope for Northamptonshire before the break. The score at lunch, 233 for 5. Essex's lead, 36. Walter was on the hunt for a maiden 100 after lunch, and with Weeter at the other end, they doubled their lead. But the Essex number 4 wouldn't make it to three figures, out for 93 when Zaib got one to spit out of the footholes and rattle his stumps. Armour tried his best to stick with Weeter, but he too would fall cheaply. His score 13 when he was caught by Vasconcelos of the bowling of Keo. The host's lead was still yet to breach three figures. Snater clung on through to T. Essex in front by 88, almost out of danger, just one session left for them to make it through. Northamptonshire may have been hunting the win, but Essex weren't playing ball. Snater held back the charge. No 50 this time, but the innings just as effective. Northamptonshire finally had him. Snater was looking to clear the ropes off Keo, but only found the hands of Saif Zaib. And when Staketi too fell with more than an hour left of the session, Northamptonshire started to dream of victory. But their hopes were slim, and with Wheata continuing to deny them, they settled for a draw. Essex had pulled off an unlikely escape. Northamptonshire denied the victory they thought their performance deserved. It was a resilient showing from the hosts, typified by Walter with 93, and Wheater who finished with 33 off 174 balls. They'd been on the back foot for large sways of the game, something Northamptonshire will take heart from when they face high-flying Surrey at the Kia Oval next week, while Essex welcome Yorkshire to the Cloud County ground.